Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to use abbreviated hex codes. Uh, many people feel overwhelmed by the possibilities of more than 16 million colors, and it's difficult to remember hex codes. Fortunately, you can shorten them. For example, red's hex code is FF0000, which can be shortened to F00. This shortened form gives one digit for red, one digit for green, and one digit for blue. This reduces the total number of possible colors to around 4,000, but browsers will, will interpret FF0000 and F00 as exactly the same color. So go ahead and try using the abbreviated hex codes to color the correct elements. Um, here they give us a link for cyan, green, red, fuchsia. Um, if we look to red, F00, we can just change this to F00. If we look to fuchsia, we can change this to F0F. And cyan, it wants to be 0FF. And then green is 0F0. And as you can see over here, we've got all our colors have changed to the way that they should be. And so if we run the tests, they should pass. That's great. Uh, Abbreviated hex codes are, are really useful. I find that I like to use uh, both um, because uh, it's great to have the simplicity, but it's also great to have the um, specialist. Like if you really want to get your colors um, to a specific shade, you can use that six digit hex code versus the three digit hex code. But for simplicity, when you're especially when you're just building a fresh application using three digit hex codes is very useful. So I hope this was useful and uh, we'll see you in the next lesson.